21st century scholars, winter banquet, and more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I'm your host, Riley. And I'm your host, Victor. If you are part of the 21st Century Scholars Program and missed yesterday's meeting, there will be another chance. Tomorrow from 2.50 to 3.50, there will be a meeting in Mrs. Johnson's room. As soon as I have Mr. Robbins, period two, report to suspension room 223, community with POTS, four with Maddox, collab room two, and five with Brent Sutter, room 211. The Winter Sports Banquet will be a Tuesday, March 17th at 7 p.m. in the FHS Auditorium. Letters that were mailed home last week were incorrect, sorry. For lunch today, lines one and two, taco meat with Doritos, Line 3, soup and salad bar with potato soup. Line 4, chicken fajita or personal pan pizza. And line 5 is closed. No one was born today, so now on to weather with Israel. Thanks, guys. For weather today, it will be mostly cloudy all day with the high of 50 and the low of 41. Please make sure not to get blinded today. I'm Mr. Angelus Jr. Now back to your host. Congratulations to Ben Stevens, Cassandra Lopez Carrillo, Michelle Garza, Anna Beasley, Maddie McBee, Andrew Mounts, and Caitlin Douglas on receiving gold on their solos at state. Congratulations to Olivia Ramos and Carmina Arismendi on earning silver at state. Way to go, Ben. Yesterday, we talked about how to stop the spread of the coronavirus. Today, we are letting you know the symptoms. The symptoms include coughing, shortness of breath, fever, and a sore throat. These symptoms can appear two to 14 days. Seek medical advice if you develop symptoms and have been in close contact with a person known to have this disease. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Fun fact, snails can sleep for up to three years. I don't want to be a snail.